Hey there everybody, this is Ira and I'm back here with another new little indie game called The World Is Your Weapon. And the gimmick of this one is supposed to be an action RPG where you can use anything in the world as a weapon, which sounds like a fun little gimmick, and so I wanted to check it out. Uh, I will point out, technically speaking, there's some issues right off the bat. By the way, this is a blind first look, I have not played the game yet, just so you know. Um, right off the bat, uh, there's no full screen. And the game window is actually quite small. It's probably being stretched out by OBS as I'm recording here, but the, the game window is quite small and it cannot be resized. Uh, you can you can hit the maximize button to make it the size of your screen, but then that'll mess up the aspect ratio. So I'm leaving it in the windowed mode. There is no full screen mode. Uh, I am trying to play with a gamepad. However, massive technical issue right off the bat. Um, this game misunderstands which button on the gamepad is the A button and which button is the B button. So I had to go in already, just to navigate the menus, I had to go into, at least, th it is reconfigurable. I had to go in here and swap the A and B button, uh, so that B is cancel menu and A is confirm attack search, as is usual in games like this. Uh, the game thinks that this is my B button and this is my A button. It's, it's, um, yeah, it's, it's a problem. I'm not sure if X and Y or L1 and uh, R1 and all that will have the same problem, but we'll, we'll just have to see. Uh, as for the rest of the options, there's a few gameplay options, but there's not a lot in terms of options. I do appreciate the reconfigurable keys. I do wish there were some display options, but there do not appear to be any. At least there are some sound options, so we've got that. Um, I don't know why it says continue here, because I have not played the game yet. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and start a new game and see what's up. Save slot, okay. Save to file, I did it. <laughs> Wiko is a young weapons merchant living in a tranquil village set amidst a peaceful world. Following her dreams to become a renowned merchant, Wiko continues her search for powerful weapons. Okay. Stinkin' Stiletto, she is suddenly surrounded by slimes. Lovely, lovely image of the slime there. Wiko finds herself in trouble because she has no weapon to fight with. Oh no! But Wiko refuses to give up on her dream. She still has so much left to do. To avoid a game over from the get-go, she'll give her all in this battle. Okay. I have heard that the English translation is a little bit wonky, by the way, so we're gonna go in with that expectation and try not to be too upset by it. Okay. Ra. <laughs> Wiko thought, I can't win barehanded. There must be something here I can use as a weapon. It was then that she remembered her father's last words. Wiko, pawn me, I don't have much longer, so listen carefully. When you fight, arm yourself with anything and everything available to you. That is what it means to be a true weapons merchant. Text color change there. Interesting. Ugh. <laughs> Wiko whispered, Thanks, Dad. If you don't have a weapon, find yourself one. Okay, look for something you can use to take care of the slimes. Okay. Um, I did set in the settings menu that um, the keys shown on the screen should be in gamepad mode, and it does not appear to have worked. So again, very buggy game. Uh, moving, changing direction. Well, what's the shift key? Oh my, oh no, no, not this again. You can't just... You can't just give us a screen full of instructions, especially not in a small font. Oh my gosh, since they're displayed on the screen, you don't need to memorize them. Oh, okay. And then here's a bunch of keys that I'm not using because I'm using gamepad. It always confuses me when people make games like this that are designed for keyboard, when it's so so clearly so much more intuitive to use a gamepad for this type of gameplay. Um, wait. Oh, is it turn-based? Okay. Use an herb to restore your HP. Press the D key or pick up weapon button to pick up the weapon in front of you. Um... Okay, pick up weapon with Y? No, that gives me change weapon. Okay. So once again, folks, once again, um, the X and Y, yeah, button display type gamepad, the X and Y also appear to have been switched, so we want this to be pick up weapon, and this to be change weapon, because the game doesn't understand what X and Y are, apparently. I don't think that's saved. There's a shovel lying in the ground. No, that's X. That's not, I just pressed the X button. <laughs> All right, folks, I think what I'm going to have to do, uh, equip that. I think what I'm going to have to do is switch to the, the, uh, the keyboard, because this game is not friendly to the gamepad whatsoever. All right, no, I'm not going to read this, because I, it's not useful to me right now. I don't care. Um, 
I'm gonna go to the settings. We're gonna change the button display type to keyboard. I'm gonna put down my gamepad. And... Uh, I don't know what I just did. It's not WASD to move around, it is the arrow keys. ASDF. This is the weirdest... This is the weirdest keyboard layout I think I've ever seen. Okay. So. I'm gonna reorient myself. This is a turn-based... Interesting. Okay, I've been- I've been hit. Enter to attack. Okay. Kill the slime. Uh, weapon info unlocked. These decals can also be used as weapon. Immobilize one turn. Okay. Got some XP. So that's good. Uh, whack this slime. Did it. Nice. Ooh, there's a gem on the ground. I think I'm gonna wait. What was the wait key? Was it W to wait? S to wait. Slap, slap it. Slap the slime. Sweet. Pick up this gem. I got an armor stone. We got one more. Uh, let's shift arrow keys to turn. Okay. Okay. <laughs> I do like the visuals. The controls are super, super awkward. Um, but I beat the slime balls. I did it. Um, can I not advance the text here? Enter, space. Oh, okay. I guess I had to wait for the music to finish. That's a little annoying. <laughs> Thus, Wika successfully defeated the slimes using various weapons. I just used the one weapon, actually. She thought to herself, this is how I become a famous weapons merchant. And thus begins Wiko's foray into the wonderful world of weapons. The world is your weapon. There we go. Roll opening credits. We did it. <laughs> okay. Choose a save slot. Why? Why? Obviously, I would like to continue using the same save <laughs> Tired from the fight, Wiko headed home. Oh, cutscene. Oh, hi sis, where did you go? Wow, what a story. <laughs> Must have been crazy. I'm just glad you're alright and apparently really strong too. That reminds me... This article was in this week's Arms Week. Give it a read. Breaking news, legendary weapon discovered. There are several wonders of the world, but we've gotten word about something that simply screams adventure. An ancient legendary weapon is hidden somewhere in the world. It is known to us only as the Legend of Legends Sword, aka the LOL Sword. <laughs> okay. <laughs> After catching wind of its existence, adventurers far and wide have searched everywhere to no avail. Will you set off on your own adventure to search for this legendary weapon? I guess. Seems like that's what's happening. What do you think? Sounds like a sack full of machetes, if you ask me. <laughs> I can't be bothered, but you should totally go and find this legendary weapon. Well, you look like you're about eight, so no, you stay home, please. Just imagine the price you could fetch. I'm not gonna sell it. Wiko had no words. The LOL Sword, a legendary weapon that no one has ever seen. To imagine that something like this exists in the world, how could I not fantasize about it? Wiko thought in a trance. <laughs> you okay, sis? It's enough cutscenes, I won't play this game. Well, I was just kidding, you're seriously gonna go look for it? Actually, you don't need to answer that. It's written all over your face, and I know better than to try and stop you when you've already made up your mind. If you're gonna go, I'm all for it. Leave the shop to me, I can handle things here. In return, you'd better find it, the lol sword. Do it for dad, too. Okay. Various things to do at home. First, check the exclamation mark icons. Sure. Uh, shop table. You can sell weapons by placing them on the shop table. Up to five weapons can be placed on a single table. When placed, the weapons are sold in approximately 10 to 20 minutes of real time. The weapons will automatically be sold, even if you close the game. You will lose the weapons once they are sold, and if it's a weapon you've picked up, it will rematerialize in the place you found it. Durability and anvil enhancements will be reset, however. Cool. This is actually- there's actually a little management game in here. Place a weapon on the shop table, huh? Yeah, sure. Throw that spade down there. Get me- wow, 1300G. Oh, it's equipped. Can I not, if it's equipped? How do I unequip? Change weapon. Unequip. There's a weapon on the shop table? Yeah. Let's just, let's just sell the shovel. Yes. Ha! Look at that! Yeah, sell my shovel. That's alright, we'll, we'll pick up something else to fight with. It's a ledger of the sales made by weapon shop Wepayoyoyoon. 
Okay. It says that weapon shop, that one, has sold zero weapons for zero G. Go for a million G in total sales. Jeez. Why does this not have an exclamation mark? Traveler's sword. Haven't used this weapon yet. Use it against an enemy to check its information. Yeah, man. I'll take that. Oh my gosh. More text. See escape key or menu button. Open the menu. Perform various actions. Okay. Well, I, I don't. I didn't really need that information, actually. I, I kind of figured that one out myself. You can talk to your younger sister, pawn me to restore Wiko's HP and cure any status ailments. You can also buy various upgrades and herbs. Buy? She's gonna sell me herbs? Dude, pawn me. What the heck, man? You're my sis. You shouldn't be selling me. Ugh. You receive various forms of assistance, such as expansions to the shop or armory. Receiving such assistance will cost you money. You can buy herbs from her at any time. It will raise ever so slightly with each purchase. Okay, well, I wasted one right at the start, so... I want to buy an herb. Uh, I have two. Might as well just buy five of them for 45G, right? Get the best deal? Always a pleasure. Want some more? No. No, you little, you little so-and-so. I can't believe you're call, call, costing, eh, charging me money. That's the word I want. We have a phone. Okay, I guess this is a modern times game. Hello, this is Mr. Smith's source for all your smithing needs. Why, if it isn't Wiko, I'm always happy to hear from my regular customers. Don't you find yourself wanting a certain weapon but can't be bothered to go find it? If that's ever your situation, give me a call. I'll make you one faster than the speed of light. Faster than McDowell's. Faster than Burger Queen. <laughs> Mr. Smith always delivers. Okay, I'm not gonna read all this out loud, folks. It allows you to forge weapons you've previously discovered. And they're available immediately. You just have to pay for them. Okay. Done on my spiel now. Hello there, it's Mr. Smith, source for Bye. Why is there a arrow pointing here? We could look in the pot. It says there's an herb inside. Aw, oh, sweet. We could look in the pot, it's empty. Well, dang. Wait, hold on. What? Basic game flow. Pick up weapons. <laughs> You're, you're explaining more than you need to explain, game. We we got it. Fight enemies with the weapons you pick up, unlock info about them, sell weapons. Repeat the process to earn XP, grow stronger, and find the legendary weapon. Let's pick up various things as much as you can, use them, add many weapons to the weapons gallery. Hold on, I think there's more to my house that I wanted to check out, though. Oh, I guess not. Oh, okay. This is actually one map. I see. I see. What's this? Anvils. Repair, sharpen. Okay. Gal, uh, I'm not. This is too complicated for right now. I just want. I just want to run around and hit stuff with other stuff, please. I see. Go away. Thank you. Can I talk to you? You already know what I know. <laughs> Ambulatory old man rot. No, I don't. There are four caves in these lands. They are crawling with monsters, so nobody dares approach them. Useful information, right? Yep. Pretty useful. Oh, it's down here. It says, seems to be able to change the setting of weapon display room here. Okay. That's fine. Okay. Weapons exhibition room. Interesting. There's too many mechanics being thrown at me all at once. Okay, now, I'm pretty sure I can pick up just about anything in the map. Yeah, there we go. Flowered thicket. Let's equip that. Oh my gosh, you can discard weapons from your inventory. That's great, thank you. Uh, how about this barrel? Empty barrel. Can I, can I get stuff out of here? Ooh, 110G, nice. Empty. Uh, can I pick up a barrel? Yeah, I can. <laughs> Let's just start. I want to I hit something with these flowers first. Hello. There's so many monsters beyond the village, it's all the demon lord's fault. Wow, it does sound like something a demon lord would do. Go peeked into the well. It's too deep and dark to see anything. How about a tree? Can I pick up a tree? <laughs> tree times four. Oh, yeah. Yep. Yep. It's my new weapon. I like this one. I like it a lot. I'll pick up this as well, the water bucket. I'm still going to keep the tree equipped. Um, and let's pick up this one tree as well. 
That's probably gonna have different stats, right? What are you? Who are you? Grieving old man Brig. My wife couldn't stand being alone. She'd always come and visit. Okay. I'll leave you to your grieving. Um, wood pile. Yep, firewood. Store that. Here we go. Out into the world we go. I should have left the village. It's alright, I got my trees. We go remembered something about her father. <laughs> it was a memory from her childhood. Wiko and Pommy's father, Dirk, was an expert weapons merchant. He was a cutlass above the rest, so to speak, and also proficient with any weapon. He'd often exclaim, I'm going to collect all the weapons in the world. Wiko would frequently play and mimic her father with a blade of grass in hand. She really looked up to him. Okay. But one day Dirk was gone. A few days later... What? Came home bruised and battered. His wounds were tended to, but it was too little too late. As Wiko and Palmy stood by his side, Dirk said to them, Wiko, Palmy, I don't have much longer, so listen carefully. When you fight, arm yourself with anything and everything available to you. That is what it means to be too weapons- We already had this text earlier. This... Wiko thought to herself, That sounds epic, but I have no idea what it means. And with that, Dirk took his last breath. Afterwards, Wiko naturally followed in her father's footsteps. Somewhere deep down, she probably wanted to be just like him. Again, there's 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 too much text in this game, which is completely useless and basically says nothing. <laughs> Wiko looked to the sky and reminisced about how her father used to swing his sword. I'm going to find this lol sword and become a weapons merchant as great as he was. Wiko was reminded of her lifelong dream. Okay, I got it! I understand! We want to get the sword. This, the story of this game is not that complicated. Uh, wait. This looks to be, uh, a badden. So, kaboom. Nice. <laughs> Bundle of four trees. It packs four times a punch. Okay. Oh, leveled up. Nice. Choose your level. Oh my gosh. Too many mechanics all at once. Max HP, attack, or luck. I'm gonna go with attack, I think. Attack increased. HP been completely restored. Nice. Okay, uh, cast Weakening Magic. Let's let's change up my weapon here. I do want to use this flowered thicket as a, a, and bop bo bo them with it. 20 damage! Nice! Beautiful thicket with flowers in full bloom. It can make any town prettier. Okay. Oh, we lost a durability point. Interesting. Um, how about, how about the firewood? I do want to whack you with the firewood. Couple ammo. Ooh, that's good. That's good. Fire resistance down as well. It's thick and would hurt if you were hit with it. <laughs> good to know. Okay, uh, let's get one more in here. Uh, how about the barrel? What if I hit you? What if I hit you with the barrel? Couple. Of Twenty-six damage. <laughs> An ordinary barrel just seen about everywhere. It can be used as a weapon against enemies. Nice. Okay. Uh, let's get that slime. Let's use a single tree. Let's see what the single tree's got in store for us. Kabloom! 11 damage. Typical tree. Over harvesting's becoming a problem lately. Um, what else we got? Bucket. Whack. 30 damage with a bucket. Ooh, that was interesting. Emits water. Lightning resistance down. Huh! There's like all kinds of complex mechanics here, actually. Uh, all I got left now is my sword. It's a little boring. Can I pick up these flout? What? <laughs> okay, I can use the road. That's good to know. There we go. There's the red flowers. Keep that. Um, take this washing tub as well. Laundry set. Store. Okay. Let this dude get up here and a whack. 18 damage. Mass-produced copper sword. Anyone can use it, but no one should ever rely on it. Interesting. Oh, I've been bopped. Been bopped in my face. Um, let's see how the road does. If I hit you with the road. One. Oh, that's not good. It's a complex road. Man, I don't, I don't want that. That's useless. Oh, I leveled up again. Um, let's see. Luck means evasion. Okay. Um, I do like that. 
I like the idea of just putting everything into luck and then nobody can ever hit me. Let's go with that. I, I enjoy that. Chances of weapon durability loss have been reduced. Nice. Evasion ability increased. HP have been completely restored. Nice. Nice, nice. Um, alright. Let's use a weapon that doesn't suck so hard, maybe. Let's try the red flowers. Kaboom. 11 damage. Not amazing. Red flowers. Attack down. Okay. Um, and... Laundry set. Yeah? Whack. 18 damage. What does the laundry set do? Emits detergent. <laughs> Ice resistance down. Okay. I think that's all the weapons that I have. Everything's been checked. Um... So let's just go ahead and, and whack you with this again. Okay. Uh, I win. I won the battle. Let's go talk to this friend here. Creepy man te Tetsken. Wahaha, the water in this pond feels great. What about you, young lady? Want to jump in? It's so soothing. Yeah, that's pretty creepy. You can maybe leave me alone. I am going to take the pond. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, I can't see where I'm going now. Let's take this grass as well. Store that. Um, wacky with the pond. That was pretty good. Pretty good. Emits water, lightning resistance down. Okay, it also blocks my view of everything behind me. So let's take this little green, little green grass here. Um, take this one. Grass C. And that one. Okay, and we got enough weapons to, uh. We can whack you with the grass. I'm sure this will be very powerful. <laughs> Nine. Okay. Um. How about this other grass? Fortunately, the slimes are pretty weak. Oh, interesting. Three times attack. Good. Um, got one more here. Actually, can I pick up this grass? <laughs> Grassy patch. <laughs> okay. Um, attack you with the white flowers. Not too bad. Attack down. And uh, how about the grassy patch? <laughs> so ridiculous. Okay. Not, not great. Three times attack. Okay. I will, uh... I think, actually, I think the flowered thicket was the most powerful weapon I had so far. Let's head back into town. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. I don't think they're gonna follow me into town. Back into town. Mystery challenge. Try to survive. Survival Island has opened. Let's find out the glowing well of Peaceville. Aim for high score. Interesting. Um, where's my house? I'm up here. Yeah, here we go. So let's sell some of these weapons, I guess. And let's talk to my sis and get my, my HPs back. Hello, sis. Why don't you rest up? Yeah, thank you. I'll do that. That's why I came here. That was my plan. It's tough out there. Need help with anything? Nope, we're good. I'm all set. Uh, my shovel has not been sold yet. This weapon on the shop table. Yes. Let's sell, um, let's sell the four trees. Can I multi-select? I can. Uh, and the pond. I think that's as many as I can place as weapons. Yes. All right, I can get one more. Uh, let's sell... Let's sell this laundry set. Oh no, wait. The, patch, the grassy patch is, is the highest one. Aside from the actual sword that I'm holding. There we go. Uh, so eventually those will be sold. Um, okay, folks. I think for, for a first look, I think we've probably, we've probably done it. Yay, go us. We did it. Good job, everybody. Um, oh, there's a well over there. Alright, let's, let's do this one last thing. We're running out of time a little bit, but... What's this? A bright light shines from within the well. Well challenges. Check shining wells to take on a difficult challenge within them. Do your best to achieve a high score. It's also an easier way to get armor stones. More well challenges might be added in future updates. Take the well challenge? I don't know what it is, but yeah. Sure. Select the challenge you wish to attempt. Survival Island. I'm probably going to die. <laughs> 
Try to survive as many turns as possible on an island with countless monsters. It's over as soon as Wiko dies. You can take up to 16 weapons with you. Boost your score by surviving turns and defeating monsters. Be able to carry five herbs. Monsters may also drop them. You will not receive any experience or money, though. So this is just a... This is just a, a high score thing. All right, let me, let me grab some more of these bushes. Store that. Store that. Um, we will... Inventory. We will discard some of our weaker ones, right? Um, discard. Discard. Definitely gonna discard this road. That was worthless. Uh, tree wasn't worth very much. You can keep the rest of these. Um, let's just let's just get a bunch of these. <laughs> I felt like those were were pretty effective. Uh, actually, you know what? Let's just, like, take a house. <laughs> Let's take a house. I'm not gonna equip it yet. What else can we grab here? Somebody else's house? Yeah. Can, uh, store that. Oh, that piano looks like it would do a lot of damage. Yup. <laughs> I'm having fun, folks. Take this. How we, how we doing? We got four slots left. What else would be effective, you think, folks? There's more houses. Take that one. Uh, maybe this bed? Sure. I mean, if we're gonna go there, we might as well, you know, find out what... what all the weapons do, right? Small pond. I can take my own house, I suppose. I think I've got one more, right? Yeah, okay, let's take my house, too. Okay. Let's do it, let's go. <laughs> yes, let's go. Let's go. Take the challenge. Here we go, jumping in the well. Could possibly go wrong, my friends. That's what I want to know. I'm sure I'm about to find out. A short while later. Hey, sis. I heard an interesting rumor the other day. Apparently there's some valuable items at the bottom of the well. Whoa. How cool is that? I wish I could collect small tokens and earn a hoarder shield from a king himself. Maybe this was earlier, not later? <laughs> so that's why you should totally go check out the well. Okay. Uh, folks, we don't need to hear every character repeat every line all the time. Clear blue sky, soaring with a parachute. <laughs> okay. Don't tell me a hundred of us are going to land an island somewhere and duke it out in a battle royale. <laughs> Carried by the wind. Just let me play. I don't, I don't, just let me play. Just let me play. Okay. Survive for a long turn. Ooh, that bat is fast. Um, attack. Ooh, I'm not gonna last long at all, friends. Not gonna last long at all. Let's try, let's try hitting it with a house instead. Is that better? Yeah, that's better. Okay. Good. Level up bonus. I'm gonna go with- I'm gonna- I'm gonna put everything into luck. I like- I like it. I wanna dodge everything. Okay, let's put on something small so I can see where I'm going. Wait. Uh, let's switch back to- let's- let's try the piano. And- Miss! What is this nonsense? Oh, that didn't do that great. Resist status buffs. Okay. Um, what else we got? Oh, all of those houses were the same item. Alright, let's try the bookshelf. Okay. It was meh. And feeble is good, I suppose. Uh, let's use an herb. Let's use my house. Nice. Nice, my house is good. <laughs> uh, again, switch to something smaller. Let's just wait. Let's just let, let's just let, wait and let them all come to me, right? Uh, how about this bed? Not great. Oh, it puts it to sleep though. That's good. I like that a lot. How about this? I think this is the last one. Small pond. Not, not amazing. 
Okay, lightning resistance down. I don't have anything that does lightning damage yet, so all those lightning resistances are not that useful. Couple ammo. Just gonna just gonna hit hit you with my house over and over again, I guess. Okay, let me grab the bed again. Looks like someone's coming up on me here. Can I put you to sleep? I guess not. There's an herb there. Um Flower thicket. It's not great. I don't know how much longer I got in me, folks. Hit you with a house. The better. Uh, I'm gonna hit you again, even though I'm almost out of health. Here we go. Here's my herb. Pull out my bucket again. Oh, what are you? Gonna whack you with my house. Does feel like the most effective thing I can do. Red worm. Oh no! My house broke. That's not good. I was I was using my house. Uh oh. We got two of them coming at me at once. I think I can probably just kill you with this bucket, actually. Nope, I was wrong. Um, well, I can definitely kill you with it now. Ooh, there's a gem. Grab that, arm of stone. Uh, I'm gonna hit you with a building. Little chicken there, little chicken friend. Chicken dude. Rico can no longer change weapons. Four more turns. Oh man. Stop it. I was defeated? Holy crap! That's a strong chicken! Final score, 43-10, turns left, 50. New high score. In recognition of your achievement, you received armor stones times two. Nice. Should surely be able to last longer than that, give it your all. You know what? Shut up, Ponmi. I did my best. I'm not very strong yet. Alright, um, well that was fun. Uh, is my house just gone? Is it not gonna come back? I thought it said that the... the items will come back. Oh dear. Uh, oh, sold out. Hey, we made some money. Nice. Well, that's good at least. Left us a tip. Two armor stones. Cool. Uh, yeah, let's sell... Oh, my house is back. Alright, well, let's sell my house. <laughs> yes. <laughs> that seems like it'll get us some good money and it'll just come back. Alright, um, well, that was fun. Folks, this is The World Is Your Weapon. It is janky as heck. I'll say that. Uh, do not bother trying to use a gamepad. Uh, I thought this was an action RPG. It is not. It is turn-based uh, style combat, so it is fine to use the, the keyboard after all. And it's uh, it's much better coded for the keyboard uh, than for the gamepad. So don't even try using a gamepad. This game doesn't understand how gamepads work. <laughs> um, there's too much text. There's too much explanation. However, it is very fun. I'm having a good time and I will definitely be playing more of this. And it's just such a cool concept of just like... <laughs> you can just pick up literally anything in the world. And there you go. It's your weapon now. And you can just hit things with it. I think that's hilarious. And they all have like special abilities and things. That's actually very impressive. A lot of care has obviously gone into this. And there's clearly more mechanics that I kind of glossed over that we can get into later. So... Um, that's the world is your weapon. Uh, thank you very much for joining me for this one, folks. Um, I'm gonna play some more of it. Meanwhile, uh, if this one is not your cup of tea and you're not interested in this game, do not worry, my friends. You know, you know, I'll be back soon with another new indie game. And you never know, that one might turn out to be your new favorite game. Thank you very much for watching, my friends, and I will see you next time. Listen, everyone. I just thought you would want to know. You can pick up your enemies and use them to attack other enemies. That is a thing you can do in this game. I thought you would want to know. Uh, this game is more fun than it has any right to be, and I'm going to go play some more of it, like, literally right now.